Warning, the following gameplay you're about to witness is rated mature, 17 and older, for one or more of the following reasons listed. Please enjoy. Turn down for what? Turn down for what? Hello, travelers! Welcome back to another episode of Game Time with Movie Man. That's this guy right here. We're last left off. Well, we're gonna get to episode three of Wolf Among Us. Very requested, at least by one person in particular. You know who you are. And I've been asked to play through it, and I want to play through it too. I just uh, need to get around to recording it. So here I am, and uh, let's find out what Ichabod's all about. Either he, um, theory. Either he actually is the murderer, or he's being like very intricately framed for it, and still has just some sort of weird fetish for snow. But I'll leave that for this. So let's play. Just moving on with it all. Episode. There we go. Episode. Th oh, there's Ichabod's car. <laughs> I'm just like. Arr! Episode three. A crooked mile. All right. Play. Here we go. The previously on Breaking Bad. Now the Wolf Among Us. Our stories used to be so simple. We had a beginning, a middle, and an end. But ever since we moved to this awful city, everything's gotten so confused. Look, I didn't kill anyone. And I'm supposed to just believe you. Snow. Yeah, she lived. <laughs> I just want you to be careful. I almost lost you once, and... I'm not yours to lose. I'm not going to be an errand girl for Crane anymore. She looks like Holly. It's not Holly. It's her sister, Lily. She was looking to pay down debt. Eventually, the only people she owed were at her work. You know, that shithole club, the pudding and pie. My name is Nerissa. Little Mermaid. Well, Nerissa, I've got some questions. Open arms. Oh my god. Yeah, Petra Lily was killed. And then the photos. Oh boy, those photos. What is it? <gasps> it's Crane. Crane. Yeah. Oh, right where we left off. <laughs> I gotta get back to the Woodland Apartments. shot. That piece of shit. That motherfucking piece oh, of shit. Oh god. Crane? Oh. Uh, god, <laughs> oh, I'm on rampage. Bigby, you have to tell her. I know. Oh damn, I'm out of here. What's going on? What did you find up there? You know, other than the I need to find snow. Just need to find snow. I can't say Crane is the killer. We don't know that What's for sure. Going on? Shit. Oh God! Jeez, I'm angry. Calm Holy down. crap! Everything's going to be fine, okay? It's She's in danger. Going to be fine. That perverted little fucker might be after Snow. I need to find her right now. Okay, it's it's going to be okay. Where did you see her last? Did she say where she was going? She took Holly to the business office to prepare for the funeral. Lily's funeral? Yeah. How do you know? I was just at the trip trap, and I heard Gren telling some folks about a funeral at the Buckingham the Bridge. Trip trap? Are you drinking? Wait, what? Right now. They're Not important now, beauty. Big B. Oh yeah, I gotta get there fast. <laughs> oh boy. Wait. What? I mean, guess don't act harshly. I, d I didn't need to keep my cool. What? Snow's... <sighs> Snow's been through a lot. There are things she doesn't talk about. Just... Please what do you be mean? careful. What are you trying to say? You know how you felt when you saw that picture? Well, it's going to be much worse for her. Just remember well, that. Well, yeah, but she still needs to know. <laughs> I'm not gonna hide this from her. <laughs> well, uh, shit. Uh, promising leads. Credits? Nope, the Buckingham Bridge. Oh, the funeral's gonna be here. So snow must be here. 10.28 p.m. 400 bucks non-stop to the Bahamas. Oh, somber. Alright, I gotta find snow. 
Ah, oh, jeez. This isn't going to be the place to do it, is it? Oh, boy. Port a toilet. That's a small little affair. You were part of a very special oh. circle. People she trusted and or the subtitles. I won't um, offend you. I'm not going to interrupt. One day that that the pain of losing Lily will ever subside. Wait, pause it. Hey now, what happened to subtitles? Oh no, not trophies, you dingus, darngus. Okay, settings, audio, video. Yeah, they're on. I guess it's just not a speaking part or whatever. Oh well. Resume game. I know as well as you that it, it will never subside. But I also know that, that the memory of wait. Lily will sustain as well. And it will, in time, An offering table. equal in strength to our mourning her loss. <laughs> and it is in Bottle that of liquor. that I'd like to talk Billy about Goat rye whiskey. what you've all been so grateful to share with me. Your memories of her. How what is she that? Could be A card. Stubborn and patient, rash and thoughtful. I'll miss she carried a torch for you. the old ways. I'll miss our for fights. Tradition, for I'll miss country, you. Pageantry. Holy. And most of all, what is that? It a seems card. How Another card, at least. Lily is that from Gren? Oh, now Vivian. you will never die okay. from indifference. She we lead a tedious life. In good Goodbye, times sweetheart. Thanks I never for met everything. Lily, but from Vivian. What I've been Another told, card. I know in my heart that she would have liked to be here tonight. Oh, that one's grand. And now we'll have a big, bright, own. shining star of in this shithole of a town. And I miss oh. you already. Gren. I guess I'll look at over here. I mean, I am supposed to wait until she's done speaking, right? Oh, there we go. I did wait for Snow Is to finish, everything yeah. okay? No, not you. Holly, it's... He wasn't fucking invited. Holly, wait. He has no right to be here. Not after what he did. I don't want trouble. Look, Holly, I'm not here to start trouble. You throw my sister down the witching well, and you have the nerve to. Wait, I didn't decide to throw her down. I was gonna. After you lie and say I did, check When was first. I given the choice to even? Holly, wait. That was Crane. Just yeah. Crane. He disposed of Lily's body before Big B could do it anything. It was Crane. Before. I would have gladly brought him the body to you. I'm telling you the truth. Don't. That's the truth. Him. But this genuinely wasn't his fault. You can't tell me Big B gives a shit about this. Holly. I didn't know. I'm sorry, Holly. I, I didn't know he put her down the witching well. Big B I cares, do. Holly. I He's am. trying to help. And I'm sure he has a very good reason I do. for being here. But this one isn't That's on also him. true. Thank you. Why are you here anyway? And don't say it's because you care about this. I'm here Everything to talk to okay? Snow. I'm here to talk to Snow. Oh, really? Yes, Holly. It this is. is serious. Okay, okay, look. Bigby and I are going to have a little chat far away from <laughs> the ceremony, alright? Don't worry about it. Look. Holly, I know how this must No, you don't know how this must feel. You have no idea. Oh. Don't fuck anything up. Don't bother okay. anybody. And when the first sign of trouble comes, and it will come because you're a goddamn walking trap for it, I want you the fuck out of here. You hear me? Of course. Of course. You won't even know I'm here. Let's just continue. Okay? Who is she? This is such total fucking bullshit. Let's go, Holly. It's your turn to talk. Oh. <sighs> okay, now. This better be. You got no idea, important. sweetheart. It's been hard enough making a connection with these people. When you pull this kind of stuff, it just Crane's obsessed with you. Clock. Snow, Crane is completely obsessed with you. Oh my God! If this no. is about how Crane treats me at work, just I... listen to me for a second. This is all right. I followed a lead to this shithole motel, the Open Arms. Crane had a room there, and he's been taking prostitutes, or at the very least, Lily, and making her look like you while he was, you know, he. 
Replays your story over and over again. This. Yeah. This, I don't it's even know what to say up. right now. I really don't. I'm just trying everything I can right now to not I'm picture it. I thought you were in danger. Him. I thought. Uh, I thought that Crane might be yeah. looking for you. Uh, I thought you might be in trouble. You're sure this is what happened? This is what it, he's it, been it, doing? It, 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 because please, Bigby. Don't confuse I'll show things. you know what? Depending I'll show you the photo. The next step. Proof? Yeah. You took a cab yeah. here, right? Yeah. I'll drive. Snow? Narissa? Narissa. What is it? I'm sorry, but Holly's asking for you. Are they starting the burn? Yes. Everyone who spoke should really be present for this part. She's kind of distraught. You're not leaving yet, are you? Two minutes. I don't mean to be... Um... No, I understand. It's just that something's come up. Take your time. No, I get it. Take your time. It won't right. take long. How'd it go? At the motel? Well... Did you uh... find anything? Yeah, thanks. No? I, uh... I did. It helped a lot. Yeah, Thanks. be vague. <laughs> Narissa! Uh. Yeah, um... Coming! Not gonna tell anybody anything else just yet. Constable? Oh, shit! Wait, wait, wait. Oh, now, oh girl. God. You know how this goes. The first thing in a visit, you say, uh. how do you do? How do you do? Now is not the that time. Way, it's proper. Now is really not the time for whatever you jagoffs are planning like to shotgunning do. Shotgunning my... Well, isn't that the thing of it? Plans. Except it isn't our plans you should be concerned they sound similar. with. We'll snip to the chase for all sakes. A little bird told us that you're fit to go after Crane. And you see, we have an interest in that Of course you do. Boy. So you leave Crane alone, and we'll leave you alone. Just take a little vacation is all. Don't even have to go anywhere. Just sit in your you work for Crane? And to heaven for a few short days. Are you working for Crane? Did he send you? No. See now, you're already asking too many questions. Just pay attention. Oh god. So what's it gonna be? We have a deal? You leave Crane alone and we leave you to yours? Ah. Uh... Brother. Fine, it's a deal, it's a deal. Fastly now. Yeah, fine. I'll leave Crane alone. Just get out of here. Pleasure to hear it. Ladies, gentlemen, invertebrates, please, rest easy. This is not... What the hell is going on? What's happening? Very sorry to impose, but we only had a deal to work out with Bigby. And we're happy to report that everything went smoothly. So if you'll just allow us to get out of your hair... Bigby, what is he talking about? Never you mind that, it ain't any of your- What deal? D, time to leave. I said, all right already. Just go. And go we shall as- Get out of here, we don't need this at a funeral. We won't ruin any more of the wedding, or whatever. Oh shit! What did I tell you? What I'm trying- say? Holly? I'm tr- Think you motherfuckers could come no here on the shit. Fight? You think you could just fucking interrupt the yeah, funeral? Calm down, darling. Just a <laughs> oh shit! Okay. You fucking freaks are not getting away with this. Holly, it's not worth it. It's not worth it, Holly. They'll leave on their own. Yeah, let's spare all the fuss. It's oh, oh, you can have them. Oh shit, Holly! Oh, take him out! I got it, damn! No! No, you bastard! Get the shotgun out of here, you asshole! You fucking sub blow your head off, you fucking prick! No, Grin! Oh shit! Ah, I'm hit too! God! Ow! Ow! No! How's. No. No.
belly full of stones. Well, shit. I mean, she's a fable. She'll heal up, right? Or is like, like, is that dead, dead? I mean, I try to maintain the peace, but look what that, look what that brings us. Shit. Bring shotguns to a funeral, and look what happens. But they were, they really asked for it. <sighs> load, damn you, load! Episode 3 A Crooked Mile. Very well. Wonder if we'll meet the crooked man. The advantage of me up. Who's that? Fable Town Business Office, the Woodland Building, 11.43 p.m. I did as well as I could to take out the buckshot, but there's still some shards left embedded in your shoulder. Are. They'll eventually worm their way out on their own, but until they do, I you're bet. gonna be sore. Bigby, Dr. Swain oh, they're fixing the mirror. Fable Town Physician for a reason. It's okay. There's only oh, that's Dr. That Swain. Take away from all this. Take it yeah. easy. Don't go looking for any more fights. Keep How's everyone else? Hard. How's everyone else? They all make it. Good. They're fine. Good, good, good. I had everyone that got wounded good. sent home. Holly refused to let me see where <laughs> she lived. So I left her and Grendel back at her bar with a dose of juniper and spring water. As long as they're okay. The Titans, Bigby. They'll be fine. Just remember what I said. The stitches won't hold up if you continue to act like <laughs> you normally do. Everything in moderation. And uh, eat more chicken. <laughs> Your blood pressure's through I'll the proverbial try. roof. I'll try to. Alright then. Very good. Business office. I know. I'll have to call you back. The town is starting oh, to find out. Well, I'll leave you two to it then. Miss Wall? Politics. Big B? Oh, hello, Snow. So, to recap... Crane watched me through the magic mirror uncover his room at the mm -hmm. open arms, and then he smashed it so we couldn't use it ourselves yeah. to go after him. And we know this because Buffkin was drinking in the <laughs> rafters. Not about cover it. And once he puts all the pieces back together, it'll be easy to catch Then you could reassemble the mirror like that. So, I guess that's the plan. Currently, but I, I don't know. Crane's getting away. We don't have time to wait for the mirror. Crane could be getting on a train sure. right now. Well, I don't want to just go running off into the night without some direction. What the hell is going on? Just, I don't know what the Tweedles get out of this. I don't Probably know if money. Crane sent them. I don't know if, I mean, this is going to sound crazy, but do you really think Crane did it? Everything points to him. I I'm, get it, but do you really think I'm he not killed sure. those women? Because it's just... I'm as confused as you are, to be honest. I don't know. It just doesn't, it doesn't. make sense. He's... He was a mm. conniver. A, yep. a coward. Indeed. A liar. And I'll always hate him for that. And I'll hate him for how he held me in uh. his thoughts. But murdering prostitutes? Oh! Ow. Everything Careful, okay buddy. over there? Yes, Miss White. I just cut myself on a piece of the glass. Nothing to worry about. <laughs> Thanks for tonight, by the way. E. That could have gone really terribly. I mean, even worse than it did. I feel bad for Holly. I'm glad you were there. I just feel bad for Holly, really. Yeah. Time heals everything eventually. At least, I hope so, yeah. for her sake. Can I, um, ask you a question? It's kind of personal. And I don't want to offend you, but after sure. tonight, it's okay. on my mind. Sure. It's just, when stuff hits the fan, like, like it did tonight, it feels like before we came to the city, it feels kind of like home. And I've heard it said that maybe in some 
tiny little bottled up way deep inside, you kind of enjoy it when things go wrong. No. Because it gives you an excuse to just, you know, stop Why bring this pretending. up? Why even bring this up? I guess it doesn't matter. Uh, guys, we have a oh, problem. Miss what is it? I can't missing finish piece. the mirror. It's Great. missing a piece. The Ichabod taken. What do you mean, missing a piece? Yes, it's. Crane uh, must have taken it. It's not here. Crane must have taken a Great. shard with him. Oh, I can't believe this. I saw Crane pick something up after he smashed it. I'm sorry, I didn't realize what it was until now. Well, the mirror can't work unless it's whole. Well, that's not entirely uh, true. Or what, Buffkin? What? We sit around and wait until it mends itself? We have no idea how long that will take. We're just gonna have to do this the hard way. I'm just saying, waiting is an option. No. What's the hard we way? Can't depend on the mirror. What exactly is the hard way? We'll look through his things, oh. his desk, yeah. everything. He had to have left something that tells us where he's going. He's a neat freak, but he was never huh? that smart. Smart enough to take yeah. this the mirror. We can still solve this ourselves. I know Never that. Never mind that. Come help me look. Oh, what about Buffkin? Probably knows a thing or two. You know, I'll talk to him for a second. What's up, Buffy? Buffy Buffkin? Hi, Mr. Bigby. I can still help you catch Crane, you know. Oh, yeah? Yes. I saw him jump on the telephone before he left. He called up somebody. He said he needed to see his witch, or that he would need to get to the witch for that. Whoever that is. His witch? Yes, it sounded like the one he got his snow glamours from. Hmm. Hmm. See anything else? You didn't see anything else, did you? No, not, uh, not especially. Hmm. It's not your fault. Look, uh, the whole mirror thing, it's not your fault, all right? It's not, it really isn't. Yeah. How would you have known? All right, um, yeah, I'm good. I'll just see if I can do anything about this. All right, you anything else on the desk we can search for? I've done the talk and I need to talk. Uh, let's see. Crane's desk. Oh, there's a hotel with a key. Yeah, 207, yep, there. What is it? It's the key to his room at the open arms. You still haven't told me what was in there. I want to know. I need to know. Blood and flowers. A lot of blood and flowers. I keep thinking back. I keep replaying moments in my head. Interactions with him when he'd catch me in the elevator or bump into me outside. <sighs> There's only so much you can repress, you know? You couldn't have known. Snow, you, you couldn't have known. No, I could have. Come on, let's keep looking. Alright, what's in the drawer? Locked. Uh, how about we bust it open? There we go. <laughs> Book. It's biz, the Office of Business Affairs and something or other? There's a page here that was torn out. Oh, yeah? Buffkin, do you know what was here? Uh, we. It's a ring, oh. at least. Every magical item not retained in the armory is assigned to someone in Fable Town. It must be this witch he is going huh. to see. Wait, what witch? Buffkin overheard Crane set up a meeting with a witch. Well, yes, it sounded like the one he got his, uh, you glamours from. It must be about this ring. Why not mention this before? No one asked me. What? Buffkin! <laughs> and I'm hung over. I'm over. Oh my god. He set the meeting at 2 a.m. Oh. Tonight. What's going on? Is the mirror Oh boy. Dead? Bluebeard, this isn't the time. Is the mirror fixed or isn't it? You called I me I called to... just to see if you knew where Crane could be, and that was it, okay? 
And I'm sorry I said anything more than that. Well, you did, and I know. The cat's out of the bag. So, can we find the dull pervert or not? The mirror can't be fixed. Is your concern? No, it can't be fixed. It's missing a piece. This is none of Bluebeard's business, Bigby. None of my business? Crane's the murderer. He escaped. It seems he spoiled your every attempt at locating him. And now it's none of my business? We don't know if he's the murderer. Oh, please. Of course he is. Look, this just isn't the time. He took a piece of the mirror so we can't use it. The only thing we know is that Crane's going to see a witch at 2 o'clock. <laughs> Just looking at him. AM or PM? AM. Listen, Bluebeard, you're not a part of this. I don't think you're in any position to turn away. What do you, help. What do you know about Crane? Fine, help. What do you know about Crane, anyway? That he has the stones to kill prostitutes like any common sex frightened serial killer and not face a real Makes challenge. a bit of sense. Look, we know that Crane is going to see a witch, and it's to acquire a magic ring. What's the ring? We don't know what it does or who it's assigned to since Crane tore its page out of the book. This farce was your ridiculous idea for a plan. I mean, who put you in charge in the first place? Fixing the mirror was the most logical You're thing. You're a secretary. He's the sheriff. And none of you were chosen to run this office. Who elected you to make these decisions? Nobody, but that Who doesn't... elected her to spend my money? Well, I've been doing that Snow unofficially can... for years now. Unofficially Snow can handle it. Not officially. Snow can obviously handle this, so let's drop it. Well then, excuse me for having the Any commonwealth. <sighs> All right, let's just look on the bright side. We know Crane is going to see the witch that's been supplying him black right. market glamours. Thanks yeah. to me. And <laughs> that he'll be there at two. So that gives us. A few short hours to find out who it is and where they live and get them all, all right. at once. And a few shorter hours, the more you babble about it. We haven't been. Tell me where to look. Babbling. Yeah, yeah. Just point in the direction you want me to check first. Since Lily used the glamours, she'd have known who the witch was, and I don't think Holly's burned her things yet. It would probably have the address or a phone oh, number. Oh, she's or not something. gonna like that. And Bigby is free to go there if he likes. But I think the question you should be asking. Is just what do the two Tweedles know? Also about true. This? It doesn't matter what they know. After tonight, they never go to their office. They're not smart enough to try and go anywhere else. The trip trap is the better option to track the witch down. That has I to be our focus. I always do both. Look, chances are I'll have to swing by both anyways. So. No, chances are you'll well, okay. have time. I don't really care what you two do. I'm going to his apartment. What? You can't just go up there. And why the hell not? We already looked for the key, remember? I don't know where it is. Then I'll pick the blasted lock! <sighs> I've wasted enough time waiting for the mirror to find him. I won't waste <laughs> any more. You just can't go up there alone, all right? I've no interest in nicking his drapes, my dear, if that's what concerns you. What concerns me is you traipsing through possible evidence. Oh, now it's evidence. Before you had no interest, and <sighs> just now stay out of it. Scene. Bluebeard, just stay out of it, all right? You'll just mess things up further. I can't get any more. You say that. Up. We have to find the witch, Bluebeard, since that's where he's going. Or the sniveling weasel chickened out. Never went anywhere. And is upstairs right now in his pitiful penthouse, crafting a fort out of... That's exactly cushions. what's happening, Bluebeard. Look, this is how a smart person would do it. So this is how we're going to do it. Wherever you go, I'll go to the other. I don't like you going anywhere unsupervised. He's up to something. I don't know what it is, but we don't have the time to really worry about it now. Where are you gonna go, Bigby? Find the find the witch. Oh man. Decision. Oh god. Decisions, decisions, decisions. So you leave Crane alone, and we leave you alone. I'd love to join you, but there's some business I need to attend to. No, no, I'm better off dealing with things alone. I don't need sympathy, and I don't need charity. Huh. So you leave Crane alone, and we leave well, you alone. Pause you it right here. <laughs> What choice will we make, or shall I make, or other? I guess you'll find out in the next episode of Pokemon Spy Travelers.